Hey team, I'm Nick. And I'm George. And we're Team Genie. And what we're going to talk to you about today is how to work out your calorie intake. Now, whether you want to be on a deficit to reduce body fat, or whether you want to be on a surplus to increase body mass, or whether you just want to maintain your calories, George is now going to talk you through how you work out your daily calorie intake. Okay, so we're going back to school a little bit with this one. Um, in short, the first thing we need to do is work out our BMR, our basal metabolic rate. In order to do that, all we do for males, you times your body weight in kilograms by 24, which will give you clearly a total number. Um, for females, same thing, in kilos by 22. That will give you your basal metabolic rate. As we explained in the last post, um, this is how many calories you consume just for existing. On top of that, we then need to work out our TDEE, so total daily energy expenditure. Again, we covered it in the last post. If you are sedentary, so you're not very active, you have a desk job or you work from home, you don't do much uh, and you don't really exercise, you will times this total number by 1.1. Lightly active, so you move around a little bit, but still mainly a desk job um, and you go to the gym once or twice a week, you'll times it by 1.3. And then moderately active, so again, um, you move around a little bit, you move around quite often and you go to the gym three to five times a week, you'll times that total number by 1.5. Highly active, you've got a busy lifestyle, so you move around, you're on your feet quite a lot, and or you exercise a lot, um, we'll times the number by 1.7, so we're highly active. So all we do, the total number from here, times by this will give you a total number. That is the amount of calories you should be on to maintain your current weight. So total number, maintenance calories. So if you stick to those calories, in theory, you shouldn't gain or lose any weight. In summary guys, the equations are here to work out your daily calorie intake. If you're looking to reduce body fat, as a general rule, if you lower your daily calorie intake by 500 calories, you will lose one pound per week. Everybody's body is different and we lose weight at different rates. So remember, you may need to adjust that slightly. However, the equations are there and that's how you work it out. Have a great day.